Now, a 10 News Morning Original. New reporting, first at 6. San Diego County could soon ban the pesticide that's at the center of hundreds of lawsuits. 10 News reporter Jared Ahrens is in the Live Center. And Jared, this is the key ingredient we're talking about in Roundup. Yeah, it's called glyphosate, and the county uses it at parks and along roads. The company that makes Roundup was just ordered to pay billions in three different lawsuits from people who say it gave them cancer. Now for San Diego, this change isn't about avoiding lawsuits. They say it's about protecting the planet and the people. Lakshmi Amorluz brings Angeline to Waterfront Park every day. It's just very close for her, for her home, and we get to just enjoy being out in the park with other children, and it's a gorgeous location as well. But as her nanny, Lakshmi is always thinking about safety, and at the park, that includes keeping Angeline away from chemicals and pesticides. So many grass areas are necessary to have some kind of chemical product, but it's difficult in parks because of the kids and just knowing that they're constantly with their hands in their face or in their mouth. It may not be a concern much longer. Wednesday, the Board of Supervisors will look at a proposal to ban glyphosate use by the county. But we think in the interest of protecting public health and protecting our planet, uh, that we can get the same outcome. We can, we can manage to get rid of weeds, but in a more responsible way. But there's debate about the danger. The state of California lists glyphosate among the chemicals that cause cancer under Prop 65. And the WHO's International Agency for Research on Cancer says glyphosate is probably carcinogenic to humans. But the EPA released a report in January saying it, quote, did not identify any human health risks from exposure to the chemical. The problem is that it's everywhere. Elizabeth Fata and the group Non-Toxic San Diego have been pushing for this ban for years. They say the dangers are too great to ignore. It seems to me that we are on a war with nature. We shouldn't be in a war with nature. We are part of nature. We have to be at peace with nature and work with nature instead of doing the opposite. And there are several other cities in California, including Carlsbad and Encinitas, as well as L.A. County and the entire UC system that have already banned or restricted the use of glyphosate. The supervisors will vote on the ban at their meeting tomorrow. In the Live Center, Jared Aarons, 10 News. Thank you, Jared. Seven